Hey guys, Joey here. So we have my dad here today and he's going to help us do a DIY video on a Thetford toilet seal. Um, the purpose of this video is to show you how to replace it yourself and uh, hopefully save you anywhere from 100 to 150 bucks for having the shop do it because this is relatively easy and the parts are pretty cheap online themselves. I will post a link down below in the description for you guys and Mike's going to show us how easy this actually is. All right, this is the residence toilet they use in RVs. It's got the ceramic bowl on it. This comes in a high and a low. Uh, the seals are all the same part numbers on those. Uh, most parts are all the same, just a high and low model. Um, but you'll be surprised how easy this is. We've removed the toilet for uh, viewing purposes on the video. A lot of times this can be done without even removing the toilet from the RV. The first thing you want to do is turn off the water supply. Get yourself a towel underneath the toilet here in the back. Loosen up the hand tighten nut. You don't use any wrenches on that. You just turn the nut, take it off. Um, you'll look in through the back here. You can actually see we've loosened up two bolts. These two bolts require a 3 8 inch wrench or a 3 8 ratchet. That's the size you're going to get out of your box. Now I'm going to take one of these off so you can see it. There's actually two washers on there. A steel and a plastic one. The plastic one is going to be against the ceramic base when you put it back together so of course for video purposes we took a shortcut and already loosened these up for us now all you have to do at this point once these two bolts have been removed is to rotate the ceramic top from the base and we do that by grabbing the base grabbing the ceramic top and we're going to turn it and you see that there's some plastic retainers in there that we're rotating and the toilet is going to lift right off once I turn it. And what that's gonna allow me to do is to lay it over on its back. And right here is the seal. It's that simple. So we're gonna take the seal off. We're gonna discard that seal. Then we're gonna get out our new seal that we purchased online. We're gonna get this seal. We're gonna put some Vaseline on it like you see there. And the trick to this is to get this seal so it's centered. Um, Vaseline is your friend here. Um, it's gonna help keep the gasket centered. All we're gonna do is reverse the procedure now. We're gonna lift the ceramic bowl up. We're gonna put it on, on a slight angle and we're gonna rotate it and lock it into position. So now I've taken the toilet, we set it up on top. We look through the back and then we rotate it into place and as you rotate that you will be checking the seal on the inside and as you look down in there you can see that the seal is a little bit off center so if it's not centered it'll still leak so we want to get that back on center and so we can adjust this back over and re-secure it we're going to line up the bolts I'm going to check the seal. It looks good now. We're all lined up. Got the washers in the right orientation with this plastic against the ceramic. And we're going to hand tighten these. Get them both started before you tighten either one of them. Get those in the hole. And to make it easy, just use a little quarter inch drive with a 3 8 socket. Tighten up the two bolts and you're done. That was an easy $150. Um, take this to a shop. That's probably the minimum you're gonna pay. So this really does show you how simple things can be So all right guys, so that's pretty much how it's done I mean, I know we're not in the RV and we didn't show you taking the toilet off itself, but that's just two nuts typically um, Rarely there are some bolts that have four and it typically it takes a half inch wrench to remove the nuts um, on the toilet itself when it's mounted inside the motorhome so if you have any questions, please feel free to comment below. We'd love to answer them for you. And if you're not already subscribed to our channel, uh, please do so for more great how-to DIY RV videos with Joey and Mike. So until next time, safe travels out there.